certainly if that's where our mobile phase will be transferred through. Actually. Yeah, because this is where we're gonna be filtering. We'll make it into here, and then from here, this will be poured through our filter. And then we'll vacuum filter. And then from here, we have a vacuum filter solution. That vacuum filter solution will then go in the mobile phase bottle. And we need it stirring at 800 RPM for at least 20 minutes. Same procedure as before. Dairy washing is about 10 to 25 ml each. Make sure all of your surfaces are good. And again, I'm going to use the transfer pipette just to make sure that I'm rinsing down all the way to the sides here. To do this entire cleaning for the quantitative method, which does not require standards, we used about 250 ml of ACM. And that's about how much is required to clean all of this glassware and to make sure that it's ready to go to not introduce any impurities into our final. So, first thing we're gonna do here is grab a 0.2 micron filter paper. Add it in here. Combine this. And then clamp it down. And then I'm going to clamp it so that way it's out of my way so I can see. So notice we need to wet this. But I don't have anything that I would like to combine in here yet, so I'm going to have to wait until I prep my 70-30 mixture. And then I will add a little bit of it, pull it through, and then discard that first washer. So, let's go ahead and start this. So to make a 70% ACN, 30% water solution, all we need is 700 ml of acetonitrile and 300 ml of water. Add those together, mix for 20 minutes, back in filter. To reach my 700, I need an additional 200 of this. And it doesn't have to be perfect, but I'll try to get close. So we currently have 70% acetonitrile in here. Let's make sure we document what's in here. And then we'll be adding our 300 ml of our water. So now we can go ahead and get our 300 ml of our HPLC grade water. no extra volume in here from that ACN. Again, negligible quantities, but try to be perfect. Do what you can. Okay. 
So this is important. When we add aqueous and organics, we will always have bubbling. That bubbling is important to remove before we put it into the instrument or else you're going to have issues. So watch as we add this, see what happens. You'll see the opacity increase because there's turbidity due to the bubbles. Okay. So now we need to make sure that this stirs for 20 minutes. But before we do that, I'm going to also combine some previous bubbles. 